So here we go again. I'm Christian Koch. I'm the test manager for the ocean cleanup. This is the second time I go offshore, but this is the first time I spent six weeks in the Great Pacific Garbage Patch. Super happy to be out here again. And uh, now we have the opportunity to witness something quite important that's happening in our project and that is making our system bigger. Uh, because last year was really about proving uh, we can make it work and we did make it work, but that was a system of 800 meters long, worked well, we got some good extractions, good catch, good success overall. But if we want to tackle the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, we need to be able to get more out simply. First approach to do that is to simply make the system bigger and that is what we've been doing uh, for the past two trips. You can see we are starting deploying the system on when you're finished in maybe two days it will be about uh, 1700 meters, the longest we have had in the ocean so far. So what we are doing right now is we are putting the extraction section on and uh, preparing for put the last wing section. For the first time this trip we've reached uh, 1750 meters left. Then we uh, started towing the system and uh, the drag, meaning the pull of the system, was a bit higher than our expectations. Nothing dangerous, but when you think about the potential next step of going even bigger, uh, that's the first question that arises. It's actually, to be fair, really big. <laughs> So we have the vessels uh, sitting uh, almost one nautical mile away uh, apart from uh, each other and this massive system behind it. So we can see this in the water, it's quite impressive. It's the longest system that we deployed so far. We had a clear test plan with uh, high expectations. We started out a bit too south and then we got uh, hit by some weather. A bit surprising weather for uh, the summertime. We had constant wind of at least 20 knots and we were forced to go against the wind. So that pushed us in not a really good place and especially for 10 days-ish, the system was quite battered. Then half the trip we realized that um, there were some damages in the system. Things were looking, yeah, well, not, not so bad, no big damage or anything, but uh, still, a lot of little issues here and there. Doing some repairs to make sure we're able to catch some plastic and it looks like we've been catching some plastic. We reached uh, an interesting uh, area in terms of plastic. So even if we're working in reduced configuration to avoid damaging the system further, we are uh, getting stuff in. We're getting data of course, but also plastic, which is uh, what we're here for. So all good in the neighborhood. Something I won't forget. All in all, it's a good uh, reality check. We didn't tick all the boxes, but uh, we learned so many things and now we have a clear plan on where to improve the system and how to do it. And we are planning to test different things in trips 16, 17 and 18 to understand which is the best way forward before getting bigger. In the end, yeah, we do need to go bigger and whether it is with this exact version or something a bit different is something we still have to decide and something we want to take the time to decide because there is no point in uh, just rushing being big to being big. 